Okay, before we continue with exercise 2.9, I want to give a quick shout out to a local artist, uh, Scatterbrain Tees, that made this awesome shirt. This is one of my favorites. I've had this one for years. This piece is called the Atonal Apocalypse. Of course, it's the Four Riders of the Apocalypse, but if you look closely, you got a banjo player, a drummer, an accordionist, and a bagpiper. And it just so happens that these are four of my absolute favorite instruments, <laughs> so I had to have this one. Uh, um, so we're going to work on exercise 2.9 now. This is on page, oh, I think it's page 8 in the book. Nope, page 9. Page 9. So exercise 2.9 is basically what we did with exercises two point, uh, with exercise 2.7 for the lower hand. This is for the top hand. So we're going to go E, start on E, F, G. So we've worked our way up to G. Then we reset to F, F, G, A. And then we just do this fun little G, F, G, F to finish off. So let's see. Yeah, we'll, we'll do the same thing. We'll, we'll play three notes, reset, play three notes, reset. So here we go together. I'll turn this way so it's easier to see my hand. Remember that your pinky should be up on the lower hand here. How's that transition from G to A? Does it feel good? If it didn't, go over it a few times. Um, now picking up on that G. Good. Now, I got a little bit lightheaded there. If you're standing up, don't be standing up. Sit down and rest your, rest your chanter on your knee or on your table or something so you can stay relaxed and also so that all this all this uh, blowing doesn't doesn't knock you out. Um, let's do that again. We'll do it smooth right from the beginning to the end, but nice and slow. Okay, we're going to do it two more times, once a little bit faster than that, and then again a little faster still. So here we go, starting from E. One, two, ready, and. Okay, one last time, a little bit faster. One, two, <clears throat> no, faster than that. One, two, ready, and. Good. 